This is a vision demo for an emergency operations center of the future. Low Earth orbit cellular communications and augmented reality devices provide solid connectivity. Most response personnel are not full time, so Faye, our incident commander, is playing pool when she gets an alert. She slides her handset into an augmented reality headset. Looking at the alert, she realizes that she needs more details on the emergency, so she activates the EOC, bringing up a series of screens for her virtual emergency operations center. She sees that the tsunami warning is in effect for her area, and acknowledges the EOC activation. Next, she sends an alert to all of her area commanders to get them into action. This is using speech recognition to dictate to the system. A tsunami warning requires public notice, so Faye activates the sirens. Her protocol checklist has a number of items, including notifications and assessing research products to identify the extent of the emergency. As her area commanders come online, Faye sees that her best opportunity to get to the physical EOC might be right now, so she messages the team that she is on her way. In emergencies and exercises, it often takes a long time for personnel to arrive at the physical EOC and a virtual response can get essential operations going without delay.